Hello and welcome to Fallout New Vegas. So last time I helped out with a few things around Freeside. Basically just making sure I could... Yeah, I've already lost my train of thought. Oh yeah, helping the followers gain a few... Um... Oh, these guys. As I was about to say, I was helping the followers gain some of their people back for for fixing stuff up. Just some extra XP, nothing significant. Before I do anything else, I'm gonna go get rid of some of these snow globes I have. And, then, and just get some extra cash that way. Then go help out with the with the king. I've got some snow gloves for his collection. You do? Why, that's just wonderful. I'll take them and put them with the rest of the collection. So, Mormon Forest, Test Site. I can't believe I forgot. Where to, partner? I just realized that I forgot to get the one around Good Springs. Well, that was stupid. A little few extra grand in my pocket isn't going to hurt. Oh my gosh, 6,000 caps. Uh, not enough to really get the um, implants I really want. So, oh, see the king. I don't know who came up with the idea of the kings being a gang of Elvis impersonators, but they have a damn fine brain. Let's go see if he needs a hand with it. Howdy. What do we have here? Another petitioner for the king? Yes, I'd like to see the king if possible. Anything's possible, I suppose. How much is it worth to you to meet the big man? Here's 50 cat. You know what? I be Head on through. Hello there. Look, Rexy, someone new's come to see us. Poor boy. He hasn't been feeling well lately. I'm the king. What can I do for you? I was hoping you might have some work for me. Or, you know, anything you need doing? Maybe so. Maybe so. You look like you might be able to handle yourself. Tell you what, you do me a favor, and I'll have some more work for you when it's done. Sound good? What you need me to do? I'll start you off with something easy. Did you notice the bodyguards for hire near the gates when you entered Freeside? Yeah, I did. It's good money if you can stay alive long enough. Freeside is not as safe as it used to be, so the money is well earned. Usually well earned, that is. Recently, my man told me that one of those bodyguards, a fellow named Oris, is making a little too much money. He's making a killing in repeat business. Once someone hires him, they never want anyone else. I want you to find out why. Specifically, I want you to hire him, play the part of an innocent tourist, and follow his lead. If nothing happens, so be it. But I'm guessing things won't go so smoothly. Call it a hunch. So, what do you say? Sure. Uh. Okay, then. Once you part ways, return here. I'll look forward to hearing your report. Oh, and take this to cover the hiring costs. Hmm. And there goes this Bill Runty. My Joris is down there. Hmm. Where'd Boone go? Oh, he's still in the in the strip, probably. 
probably still waiting there. Well, that helps. Get off the uh, recon beret so I don't look like I'm vaguely NCR related. If you need to cross free side, no one will keep you safer than I will. Atmosphere services. Two hundred caps gets you. Okay, I'll hire you. Done and done. I want to mention a few things up front. In order to ensure your safety, I will be heading down the main street here the whole way down. No, I'll keep a. Hmm. Like, he has a hunting revolver. He has metal armor and a hunting revolver. Like, he's obviously better equipped than Mooks. Down to the right here is the fun part of town. You haven't seen Freeside till you've been to the Wrangler. Hey, slow down. I don't like the look of some of those men ahead. Let's take a different way around. This is interesting. It wouldn't be too much of a problem for me. Rubble? to worry about if you had hired one of those other hey you only fired three shots four guys there uh, notice that did you why turn your head like that call it a hunch well interesting Keep you in mind. Like hell. Well, that explains why he's doing so well. He's staging it. Cheating. King's probably gone to bed. Yeah. Hey. Might as well sit down and take a break. Take my feet off. Alright, let's see if I can't find this guy. Oh, he's probably upstairs. Man, I thought those tin cans of Mr. House were tough before. Have you seen the shit they can do now? Yes. Yes, I can. Madam? All I do all day is read magazines. You'd be amazed that you can learn from them. What do you have for me? Horus is a fraud. Makes attacks on his clients and then plays hero. So that's how it happens. Okay then, I'll have some guys. You've shown me something. So maybe you can help me with a matter that's a little more important. A lot of folks around these parts who've been here a while resent the sheer number of people that have come into the area since the strip was built. In turn, the newcomers, most of whom come from the NCR, have gotten ornery from being resented. Sometimes things get violent. This is one of those occasions. Recently, 
few friends of mine were attacked, and I want you to find out who did it. Words come that they just woke up over at the old Mormon fort just north of here. Head on over, see if they remember anything. Head over right away. Good. I like that enthusiasm. Hmm. Probably gonna need to start, um... What was it? Help it helping these guys reconcile with the NCR just for uh, leisure. So hopefully I'll one more force. And let's see what we can find out from these people. I ain't got any reason to talk to you. Scram. What is it? Can't you see I want to be left alone with my friend here? King asked me to look into your attack into your attack. Oh. That's different then. How can I help? I'll do anything to get the bastards that did this. What can you do? You remember anything about the people who attacked you? They were big guys, young too. No old geezer like me. Hell, none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened. So I only got a quick look at them. What can you tell me about the attack? Well, it happened at night, around eleven. We'd recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found and wanted to invest it wisely. As we were leaving the Wrangler, we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. From out of nowhere, these big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanted to know if we were locals. The kid there is about as proud as a local around here gets. We started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. I hope you find the bastards that did this. It's okay. The king sent them. Is that true? Did the king really send you? He did. Anything you could tell me about what happened might help. I don't really know what else I can add. They were a bunch of guys. Better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? You're not getting something from me, are you? What? No. Hey, wait. I just remembered something. I might have heard one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. We had just about had it when one of them said, Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. It might have been something else. Now that I think of it, he said Lou something. He probably said Lieutenant Wayne. The boy means well, but he's dumb as a mutant sometimes. Hmm. May not have been my best decision. I how it actually affected my... Well, accepted. That's still good enough. Let's see if, if Judy Fargus knows anything. Welcome back, friend. Now let's talk a bit about Freeside. What did... What's all the fuss about the water pump? Bill Vonte installed that pump a few years ago, back when he was sober. It was a major improvement for the community. But lately, the Kings have started... I know they sell a lot of guns. Rates of injury. Medex, Radaway, and Fixer are free side essentials. I can't pay. So it seems like you need a steady supply, not just whatever I can grab for you. So far, the Crimson Caravan won't cut us a deal. If you can convince them or some other merchant. Which merchants might be willing to make a deal? You might ask around at Mick and Ralph's, or go see the. Got yourself a deal. Just come. Hmm. Might be worth seeing if the uh carrots have anything useful there. I didn't even talk with the carrots anyway. How's it going? So, Benny's dead, huh? That shifty son of a bitch had it coming. 
Everyone says that. Anyway, followers looking to trade for supplies. Interesting. Well, you're gonna need to speak with my brother, James. He handles all of the trading contracts and general operations. Stay around. Can I go? That's easy. Very hard to walk. Not once. Actually, I might as well just go crash, go crash for a bit. And heal up some of my image. Let's see how that actually did for my. We're good. A bit higher than I'd like. I hear Benny got force fed a little slice of heaven. Man, what I would have paid to see that loathsome little weasel eat it. Hmm. Anyway, followers need someone need someone willing to trade with for supplies. Really now? Well, this is news. We could possibly supply what they need, but they would need to supply us in kind. They have the tech know-how to make our stills work more efficiently. Pure alcohol means we can get our customers drunk quicker. Getting our customers drunk quicker means more caps spent at the tables and stuffing slots, if you know what I mean. Plus, the extra alcohol can serve as surgical disinfectant for... I might be able to work something out. Good. We can supply them with all the medex they need. We're not in the business of getting people off drugs, so we don't really... The followers should... They just need to agree to fix up our... Hey, if you're looking for a smooth dog for an escort, I did find one. Hello? Santiago. That honey mouth son. Those pretty lips. I actually did find you an escort who's a ghoul and a cowboy. Her name's Beatrix. Start immediately. A she, huh? And the best place to start. Be around. She's got style, grace, and charm. The style of a. Yep, there's Beatrix. Honestly, as sleazy as the carrots are, they have some standards. All right, let's go chat with. Things are tense on the strip right now. The head of one of Mr. House's families was killed. Time to make low blood. Thing. Have you found anything out? Local men were apparently attacked by soldiers. One of the men was identified by rank. Bunch of soldier boys, huh? They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. If they're coming over here now, it's got to be for a reason. If something big is going down, I'm sure a room... You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat you. Just don't ask her what to do about it. Hmm. What's up? Music just changed there for for some reason and odd, creepy even. Come to Nick and Ralph for all your shopping needs. Yeah, I said I was gonna cut out all the back and forth, and yet here I am, just going back and forth. Anyway, let's see what Julia has to say. Great to see you again. You know anything about some NCR soldiers here in Freeside? Only a little. A friend of mine, Major... The King thinks those troops have been attacking locals. I know something's got... If you're looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. If Elizabeth holds out on you, tell her that I sent you. Was there anything else you wanted to talk about? Well, I did find someone who would be able to cover your supplies. That's phenomenal. Who did you find? The Garrett twins. 
They supply Freeside with drugs and liquor. From my point of view, they're just better organized pushers. Upgrading their stills would increase their supply of liquor and chems. How does that help Freeside? You get your chems can help anyone who gets addicted. True, we could Look, they just need tech support, raw materials. Good point. We wouldn't be paying anything for their supplies, just a portion of our food waste to make ethanol. We get food from nearby wasteland farmers in exchange for medical services, so we could put our caps back into helping Freeside. Tell the Garretts we'll keep their stills running if they prove That's the help. Yeah. Hey, Bill. Hey, thanks for helping me out. Being back and working really saved my life. Glad to be of service. Grand. All right, so I'm just gonna skip over the walking here. Hold up. What's the password? I'm here to see Major Karen on urgent business. Please let me pass. If you're here to see the Major, then I suppose it's all. Hmm. Here you go. I hope this helps. Oh, Major Kieran. You at the NCR material? Uh, military? Yes. Oh. I'm a major in the supply corps. You serve food to locals as well? No, I'm afraid we don't. I was afraid you wouldn't get served. You were right. Yes? Was it? Is there a reason you. Why don't you serve locals? That's not really a pleasure. Julie Fargus told me to ask that it was important. You know Julie? Not everyone in the NCR sees eye to eye with the followers, but they're okay in my book, mostly because of her. If you really want to know, we sent an envoy to the king, offering... What happened? Our envoy was brutally beaten, and only barely... I managed to get clearance to carry out... Now there's not enough supplies to go... That's all in the... Well, interesting. So, the NCR were trying to help, but they're... Oh boy, got got the ship beaten out of him. I can kind of, kind of see why they wouldn't want to help after that. Nice. Right, so I need to head back. Actually, spoke with Judy Farkas. She says the followers will accept your offer. Hey, that's great. Once our stills are upgraded, we'll never be short on liquor for our patrons. If Jacob Hoff is sober, we might even have a few new drinks on tap. Oh, he's sober. Lewis's drug dealing enablers around here. But honestly, we care about our patrons. It's bad business for people to get addicted. We've got enough crime in Freeside <laughs> without a bunch of strung out junkies robbing traders and gamblers to afford their next fix. Very pragmatic of you. Bye. Your end. So yeah, so saying earlier, the arts are a bit sleazy, but given the state of this world, it's not the worst around. Well, hey there. I heard that NCR soldier lady told you some wild story about them sending a messenger to us to work out some deal. That's bullshit, and it's nothing about it I can with. So do ever I still think he should know about it. That's a shame. Things are tense on the strip right now. The head of one of Mr. House's family. Bing. You find out something about them. Apparently, the NCR is distributing supplies. Uh, apparently, they are distributing supplies in a building down by the old train station. Handing out supplies? Like food and stuff? That ain't nothing to get ruffled over. You find anything else? We're only handing them out to NCR citizens. Ah, that would explain the goons. They're here to keep people like my friends away from the food. That ain't something I support. No, sir. There's a reason for it. They said someone was sent to discuss the issue with you. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. They said what? Man was attacked and driven off. Never arrived. Huh. That 
would explain why they're all riled at us. Seems like we have a big misunderstanding. What the hell? Play it on me. What's going on? There's a shootout going down near the train station. It's Pacer and some strangers. Might be NCR. What is that fool doing? I need you to. Bloody hell, Pacer, you moron! You know, if there was a sprint mechanic in this game, I would be using it now. What was that Pacer doing? Just put up the light to let them know there's something going on. Look like it to me. Oh, I think. Nice and slow. Don't want to spook him. I'm not planning to do shit to you guys. Where's the Major? Up there? Major! This isn't really a good time. What did you want? The King actually wants to help with the relief efforts. Like he helped the Envoy with- That wasn't him. He didn't even know an Envoy was sent. Then he should watch his back. We know for a fact that the Envoy made it to their headquarters. Still, if the King's willing to deal with us, perhaps we can work something out. I'll tell my men to stand down. Damn it, Pacer, you fucking idiot. Well, they ain't gonna need this shit. Magnum revolver. Don't strip him. I'd play with some dignity. The king just sent a messenger over, saying these guys are off limits. He's probably already heard about what you did here. Looks like you get to be a hero. Enjoy it while it lasts. Fuck off! I just saved your life, you prick. Nice. Here we are. Let's go chat with him. I heard all about what happened. Maybe it's time for a little more talking and a little less fighting. You've helped us plenty, so I'll tell you what. Just this once, aim whatever you want. If I can make it happen, it's done. Don't rush it, though. Toss it around in your head a little. You only get one favor from the king. All right. <laughs> Everyone explosives. It does affect the um dynamite, but might as well just clean it. Round this up just to make it nice and neat. Now, I need to. What else do I need to do around free side? Send her. Does it go boom? Wang dang atomic tango. Let's see if I can finish this off. More thugs.
Yeah, the... <laughs> Boone is basically standing around outside the Lucky 38, but I... I still have his perk. <laughs> kind of amusing. Okay, let's go see if Ralph has anything to say here. While I am at it... I think I might actually just sell off these night vision binoculars. I'm not even using them. Hey, Ralph. Hey, thanks for getting Bill Ronte fixed up. I was really getting sick of paying for water. Now, what the hell? What can I do for you? The hall tape ready yet? Yep, here you go. And Mick, got some stuff to sell off. Welcome back, buddy. Three, three, seven, ten mil, ten mil. So oh, this night vision binoculars, they're just no use to me. As ammo goes, I'm keeping this as a kind of fallback option, kind of leading into the. It does more damage than that gun, but it doesn't have as much of a EPS. Let me get the um, rail car back here. Little cowboy repeater. I do need to repair mine. Nope. I'm useful there, so might as well get some more items. I'm basically using it, using it as a precursor to getting the trail carbine because sooner or later I do want to get that. And where was I? Now over to the old electronics factory. And here we are. Bottle caps, couldn't hurt. A programming routine. Security Technotronic Officer Active. That's a bit of a mouthful. Let's shorten that to Fisto. Yes, please. Yep. I am. My pleasure is for you to work at the Atomic Wrangler. Fisto will. Report to the Atomic Wrangler. James Garrett is your new owner? Yes. Well, this is. Yeah, this is weird. Friend, what can I get you? Found the bot you were looking for. You did? For my Yeah, it's a heavy duty piece of equipment built to last. Hey, I'm amazed you even found the thing in the first Here is He's already programmed to respond to your command, him your owner. It is. It didn't have looks like that kid. Nice. nice. Now what? Well, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here and things that go boom might be a good one to start out next. Right, so I'm gonna leave this episode here and the next one I'm gonna go go talk to the boomers. See you around.